Socratic questioning. Socratic questioning is actually a very detailed topic that's covered across many disciplines from education to psychology to counselling. But in essence and in the context of education, Socratic questioning is about probing students further to get more information and more richness in detail from them. The intention of simplifying Socratic questioning even further, there are four roles you can adopt within the classroom as a teacher which will allow you a practical framework to ask Socratic questions. These roles are the gadfly, the stingray, the midwife and the ignoramus. So you could be like a gadfly asking more probing questions. Why do you think that? Why is that important? Where's the evidence for that? Does that work in every situation? Can you apply that in the real world? By being a gadfly and chipping away at students, you can definitely dig deeper into their knowledge on a particular topic. Alternatively, you could adopt a more supportive approach and take on the role of the midwife, where you are looking to give birth to new ideas. In this role, you'd be asking students questions which encourage them to think of new ideas, build upon ideas, and generate new ways of looking at the world. The third role you could adopt is the stingray. This is where you administer a shock into the discussion every now and again to challenge conventional ways of thinking. So you could ask questions such as, what if the opposite was true? What if that never existed? Or could you still achieve that if I removed this main element? Or you could adopt the role of ignoramus. This one sadly comes quite naturally to me. As the ignoramus, you pretend to know absolutely nothing about the subject, asking students why. Why is that the case? But how does that work? When could that be possible? Tell me more about this. This is an effective strategy as it puts the student in the position of teacher and allows them the opportunity to teach you the subject. If you found this video enjoyable and valuable, I'd very much appreciate it if you gave that like button a quick tappity tap and turned that thumb blue. And I make regular videos about teaching and some other stuff, so if you'd like to see more, please consider subscribing to my channel. My name's Jonathan Sandling, ta-ta for now.